A 911 call in shows the shock a stepson felt when he found his stepmom shot dead in Picacho Hills west of Las Cruces. As ABC 7 has reported, Robert Yaconi, who you see behind us right here, is accused of shooting and murdering his wife, Kimberly Yaconi. And we want to warn you, what you're about to hear is intense. Our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom obtained the 911 call today. Is she breathing? No, she, she's dead. What do you mean she's dead? I don't, I don't know. She has, she's losing a lot of blood. Okay, can you get something to help cover the bleeding? No. <laughs> Where is she bleeding from? She's, she's bleeding from her face. Okay, I need you to calm down and get something. Get the towel. Can you do that, please? Oh, my God, no, she was shot right in the face. Robert and Kimberly Acconi were the owners of Forget About It, a popular Italian restaurant in Las Cruces. ABC7 profiled the business in 2017, which is how we had that video. He was previously convicted of child abuse and aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. There's now a memorial for his wife outside the restaurant. The sheriff's office said yesterday she had previously filed restraining orders regarding weapons in their home. The shooting happened at their home in Picacho Hills Sunday. Authorities were called to the scene and found the victim dead. Deputies got in a shootout with Robert Yaconi after he returned to the house. He was shot and taken to a hospital here in El Paso where he is still recovering. But before that happened, the son who called 911 thought Robert Yaconi was at the restaurant. I can't risk going over there okay. I don't know if he has another weapon. No, that's fine. It's okay. Is your dad known to carry weapons? He has a 12 gauge and like a pellet, a pellet sniper, but the, the 12 gauge is at the house. He has, I don't think he has, maybe he has a pistol and forget about it, but that's all I know. I think he might commit, I think he might commit suicide. The sheriff's office says Robert Yaconi will be arrested when he's released from the hospital.